This morning, the chairman of the South Carolina Republican Party, Drew McKissick, held a press conference to discuss the state's election results. Better here than South Carolina, certainly, than other places around the country. The full red wave that didn't seem to hit the nation appears to have hit the Palmetto State. I mean, here in South Carolina, we had the red wave came and swept in along the coast and went all the way to the upstate, uh, proving yet again what we already know, that South Carolina is a solid Republican state. Governor McMaster and Superintendent of Education-elect Ellen Weaver won by double digits. And then down the ballot really is where the, the real story is told. The Republicans gained eight statehouse seats, including districts 116, won by Matt Lieber, 117, won by Jordan Pace, and 80, won by Kathy Landy. McKissick said the Democrats may have flipped one seat. And then local races down at the county level, uh, we gained the majority of the Charleston County Council, uh, flipped the Clarendon County Council seat, uh, almost flipped two there as a matter of fact. McKissick said straight ticket voting helped with many of these wins. Republican straight ticket voters outnumbered Democratic straight ticket voters by 27 points. That's a record. I reached out to the state Democratic Party chairman for his comments on the election, but I've not heard back from them. Of course, we have a lot more on the election at our website. Just log on to countonto.com. At the State House in Columbia, I'm Raymond Owens. Count on two.